Opposition leader Stephen Marshall has been warned that now is the time to make tough decisions and rejuvenate the Liberal Party or risk having his own position called into doubt. Mr Marshall will reshuffle his shadow cabinet within days and admits Ian Evans' decision to quit has forced last minute changes. Stephen Marshall at the footy to support his team. But some say it's his own lineup that needs attention. What it will show if he doesn't make these decisions now is a weakness of leadership. That warning follows Ian Evans' announcement he'll quit politics within a year, prompting a by-election. Political analyst Hayden Manning says Mr Marshall should use this opportunity to replace other long-serving members. I think it's crucial that Stephen Marshall puts his stamp on the Liberal Party. The opposition leader admits Mr Evans' shock decision has forced him to reshuffle his reshuffle. But there's an opportunity now to bring somebody new in. It's a little bit like a football team. But he doesn't expect other senior players to hang up the boots. So you won't approach any others to go? No, absolutely not. The government says it's unfair on voters for Mr Evans to keep collecting his salary while looking for another job and insists he should call a by-election immediately. Another political analyst says that should coincide with any others thinking of quitting the party. It would make a lot of sense for the Liberal Party to have them at the same time and try and minimise the disruption that that would cause. Mr Marshall will unveil his rejuvenated shadow cabinet within days. Sure, we need to see some of those uh, new faces on the front bench uh, and that's what we'll do. Eddie Godfrey, Nine News.